They're a big part of what makes this such a great place to call home, but some Clevelanders are now finding themselves priced out of the city's hottest neighborhoods. News 5's Mike Brookbank gives us a look at the work underway to improve accessibility on the near west side. On this vacant lot in the 1900 block of West 50th Street, history will be made and a promise kept to bring affordable housing to the Near West Side. As the Near West Community Land Trust, it's a partnership between Ohio City Incorporated and Tremont West Development Corporation, breaks ground on its first new single family home in a zip code where similar properties are selling for double or even triple the price. Ohio City and Tremont have both seen skyrocketing real estate prices over the last decade. The goal with 1902 West 50th Street, deliver a house at uh, below $150,000 to a qualified buyer. This will give housing to a range of incomes uh, for families making, say, you know, thirty-six dollars to $80,000. Free land, along with funding from the city of Cleveland. There's always a lot of challenges with affordable housing, unfortunately, in this country. Are helping drive down costs of new construction and rehabbing existing rental units. Most of these units would be under $200,000. Ben Trimble tells me there's quite a bit of affordable housing in Cleveland. The problem is they're typically run down properties in need of repairs. We're trying to build a better, really clean, safe, decent, sanitary um, house in a neighborhood that people want to live in. The Near West Community Land Trust is setting out to build 10 new houses a year. We still have some work to do to create a pipeline of qualified buyers. Since this newly formed organization owns the land, these homes will be permanently affordable even when the original owner sells. There should be housing opportunities for folks of every income in our neighborhoods. Reporting in Cleveland, Mike Brookbank, News 5.